So y'all, I'm back. I started and I didn't finish. I figured I'd do the video and it'll be a little bit more detailed. Um, what I'm doing is like a little cheat sheet of different fonts I found in Canva that I like a lot. So I'm going to start with the first set. The first one was glowing rainbow letters. So I went to elements. And I put in, you see that? I need a lot of stuff. I need to do this, this. Lauren Rainbow Letters, got the graphics. And here got the letters. They, they're really cute. Um, always remember, you can go down here to um, see recommendations. And you'll have all the fonts right there. Um, another one is the Pop It Rainbow Letters. I like them also. You're going to go to elements and put in the pop it the letters will start popping up here click on one it's going to give you all the letters to choose from very colorful um, another one is the vibrant the vibrant doodle letters. I think this is good for school. And make pop it one word when you do that one too. Doodle letters. Go over here to graphics. See letters, different colors. Now the one the reason I like these is you can change the color on them as much as you want. Another one that you seen when you first got here was going to be the paintbrush stroke letters. You click on this. And let's see if I can get it. Just type it back in so you can see what kind of letters is there. Go to graphics and you see some are here. But I click on this and of course it's going to bring me all of them up. Different colors. So the sky's the limit on that one. Um, let me delete this one off. Another one that I kind of like is um, the watercolor alphabet. So let's look that one up. While I'm on here, this is a little sheet I'm going to scroll through slow on this video in case you want to write them down. Um, I want you to be able to get them all down. That's cute. This is the watercolor one. Look at that. And while we're here, I might as well let you see um, the other one, which is the paintbrush one. See, they pop up too. And a uh, way you can do this is hit the three dots at the top. Um, it's going to say view more. So I'm going to view more. And this is the person that made those letters. You type in letters, you see other letters they have that they made. This same exact person that made that 1H made this. And, you know, as you can tell, other different fonts they have. They even have a balloon font. So I think that's pretty cool, too. Oh, let me not make that my word because I don't want nobody to think that's what I'm saying. You know, I put this on TikTok and YouTube. They'd be like, oh, is that what she's trying to say? I, I'm not going to even say the word. But yeah, you get it. Um, I think this would be good for like a movie night or something like that. You know, I think this is cool to find the the uh, different fonts in um, Canva. Because if you ever go on to um, Etsy to buy a font you want to use... Those people charge an arm and a leg for the fonts, and they probably literally got the fonts from um, from Canva and just made a whole list of them and had them to sell. So if you can, if you cannot find it on Defunt, um, look for it on Canva. It's possible to be there. Another thing you can do, um, if you find a font just like in Silhouette and... Um, just like silhouette and can in um, design space, you can upload a font. 
you have to I do another video where it shows you go to your logo and put it up um, put it on there I think that's gonna be cute Like this right here. See if you I'll put it over to the side because that letter is kind of here. Um, another font. Let me think. I'm trying to think. Let's try the purple. Purple neon light is a pretty one too, I believe. Am I doing this right? Yeah, I'm doing it right. My hand's not on the right keys. And I didn't spell purple right up here. I guess they understood what I was saying. These are cute, y'all. Look, I'm making a cheat sheet. Like I said, I want you to be able to see it at the end and um, take the letters and do whatever you want to do to them. But this one here is the uh, purple neon light. Uh, a lot of this will look good if you're doing um, sublimation shirts also. I think it's pretty cool um, to do that one too. I'm doing, um, it, as I'm doing this, you guys are sitting here watching me. I'm going to not go back over it. I'm just going to do it while I am doing this video at the same time somebody might want this email it over to them pause the video go back up through them and i think i will do one more um let me see hmm. oh sorry Mm, I did paint letters. I did. Let's do the balloon. You got these. I think these are ugly, but they start getting cute. See that one? And it give you the entire alphabet like that. Look at this. This is kind of weird whatever this one is i have no idea let's keep going through the balloon letters and see if you can get some i think they have a gold one too let's see you see this is what i'm looking for something like this I don't know what you would use this on, but I mean, I'm not a designer to a certain extent. I do simple stuff enough for my customer to be like, oh yeah, that's nice. That's, that's about it. Hold on. I'm back, y'all. I had a phone call. Um, Another one that you can look for, I put in is diamond letters. Let me just keep this one here and copy it. But look at this. That's cute. That's super cute, y'all. I like this one a lot. Um, let me see if they have it in silver and gold. I'm not for sure. But I know the silver ones are really cute. Um, I don't know if you've seen when people do um, the birthday shoes or whatever. They kind of use the letters. They be blinging. So this would be the opportunity to use that right there. Let me make this a different color so you can see what it is. Kind of self-explanatory though. I know it is. Let's see if they have another color. Now they only have silver. That's still pretty cool. For the diamond letters. I said I was done. Let's do one more. Um, since they didn't have gold. Let's do gold letters. It's a lot of cute gold letters, man. I don't even know which one I like. Like, see this one here? 
that's the whole alphabet look plain in its own terms to me looking for something that got that mm, you know when you want to be all sophisticated with letters but do you do see the gold letters? Like this is cute too. So it's multiple gold letters to choose from. So this video is basically just giving you some words that I would use um, when I'm in Canva looking to make a design or something like that. This is what I use um, with that. Maybe it helps some, maybe it won't. Just let me know if it do. As always, thank you for looking and listening to Zy Creations. And until next time, happy crafting.